Hey guys, this is Tattoo Tony, and today we're going to be exploring a storefront and an abandoned apartment building. Well, this thing's cool. I can't believe it. Whoa, look at this. What do you think these benches were for? I mean, what kind of store do you think this was? Nah, it's not big enough. Anybody has any ideas what those benches would have been for, what kind of place this was, uh, go ahead and uh, comment. Up here I'm going to find a cap to a syringe and hey, a soda can. They were, here, bro. they were melting heroin in and sucking it up through, syringe, through the cotton swab. And that weird beaker measuring type deal. I don't know what that's from, for. Struck me as kind of odd. There's a cotton swab, dude. You hear me? Watch out for syringes, dude. Dude, there's a bullet. Bro. There's a bullet, dude. See it? Yeah. Here's a piece of a syringe, right? There's this weird beaker. That's what attracted my attention. And look, see that cotton swab? Huh? See it in there? The little piece of cotton? They sucked the heroin through that, dude. There's still like heroin residue on that shit. And there's a wipe they wiped their arm with. See it? See that disinfectant wipe? That's what I say, watch out. And then look, here's a bullet. See it? Can you see it? That's some crazy. So shit, I'm going to take, I'm going to take a guess that's either a nine no. Either a 9mm or a 40 caliber round. What the fuck is the machine looking That's the first one I've seen in the area. There's all these people around that look like they're fucking dope. I'm like, where's all the shit at? Yeah, we. There's a uh, kind of a drug rehab or drug counseling help thing right off this street too. I think at a Baptist church. This is also real close to where I interviewed the uh, young lady at the attic down the street. Um, this is real close too to the abandoned bar that I explored in that building. So, if you haven't seen that video or you're new to the channel, uh, go check that video out. Also, like, comment, subscribe, share. Man, next video I get that gets a fun 500 likes, I'm going to send somebody a t-shirt. I sent uh, Kathy Crutcher a t-shirt on a video that I had over 500 likes on. So, there's a thousand people that watch every single video. Hit the like button. It's not that hard. Go hit the like button and uh, leave me a comment. Say you're interested in the contest. And once I get 500 likes, I'm going to pick somebody and mail them a shirt. And uh, I'd be happy to do it on every single video if I could get 500 likes. You know, I usually get 100 and something. A few more of you people, just hit that like button. Do it right now. It's not that hard. Uh, there's some stuff laying out. There's several spots in this building where you could see people uh, maybe sleeping. Uh, one of the apartment buildings that I don't think I showed, I walked through the building real fast before Andrew got out of the car and uh, saw, saw some definite places where people were sleeping recently. There was lighters and different trash and water bottles. So I was telling Andrew I could see out these windows and there was a, uh, a couple burnout abandoned buildings across the street. 
and some addicts were standing out there um, and cars kept pulling by and, and stopping and sitting there for a little bit I wasn't watching everything that was going on but One of the girls disappeared. I don't know if they were turning Dude, tricks to try to get today. money. Make sure they ain't coming this way. So anyways, this is a pretty rough area. Probably somewhere I'd stay out of. You know, I probably wouldn't be walking around through these buildings at night for sure. What's that, bro? Hey, is that you? Tell those 3 a.m. challenge guys, 3 a.m. challenge. I got some places for them, for them to do 3 a.m. challenges. <laughs> There's a few abandoned buildings here and in North St. Louis. Uh, you know, I'd like to see them go overnight. Did you guys see that old lampshade? Man, that, that hasn't been in style for a minute. I guarantee you some of the people that I saw on the street out front of here uh, probably curl up in this building and go to sleep sometimes. I guess the attic would be a good place in the winter, maybe. They're not? Okay. Here. I kept having Andrew, uh, so you could see one of the big buildings there for a second out the window. He was kind of keeping an eye on the people out there to make sure they weren't coming over. I talked to another guy, too, when I left this building. He was kind of in a hurry, or I would have tried to interview him, but he was kind of out of his mind, too. He was high on crack. Almost nothing he was, anything he said made a lick of sense, you know, he's just, he knew how to ask for a couple bucks and a cigarette, though, but the rest of it was mumbo-jumbo. I think uh, maybe the next room that we go into, there was actually a sign on the outside of the building that said it was some sort of club. I'm not sure what. Please remember, if you haven't yet, hit that like button. There's, you know, I usually get about 2,000 views at least, and I'm telling you, I'm going to give away a t-shirt if I get 500 likes. Somebody will get a t-shirt, and it's uh, real easy. Watch my channel, and, and actually I'll pin a comment to the video that will tell you how to enter for the t-shirt, but i got to hit 500 likes. And usually only a few people enter. I sent a t-shirt to uh, Kathy Crutcher. Maybe you can comment and tell people you got a shirt from the channel. I let her pick uh, the design and the color and the size. And
I need your guys' help to uh, get this going. So if you like watching this kind of thing and you're watching a lot of my videos, you know, the same hundred and some people always hit the like button. Need more of you to do it if you want this uh, channel to continue into the future and keep exploring and finding more and more right, stuff. Cool. I hate to have to keep saying that stuff, but guys, the reason I keep repeating it is because... Um, well, if it was happening on its own, I wouldn't even mention it, but I need you guys to do it. And also, commenting helps. Commenting helps the videos. Uh, leave me a comment. If you see something interesting, like a little piece of rubble that was laying on the ground, an item, you have a question about the area, you just want to say you liked the video, leave a comment on every video. It takes ready, bro. It takes it takes me here. quite a while to make all these videos and upload them. It requires quite a bit of my time, and I love doing it. I do it because I love it, but I need a little help, guys. Indiana license plate. Well, look at this. I didn't see that before. Bunch of cool ebony magazines. From like the late 70s, early 80s. Dude, look at all these 1978 ebony magazines, dude. Dude, check these out. They're fucking badass. I almost want to take that staff, dude. But I didn't. I don't take stuff, so I didn't take anything, but I would have loved to have, you know, had all the vintage magazines. I don't need to collect clutter, though, but it was just, it was a cool find, I thought. Maybe not quite as cool as vintage uh, booby magazines, because those seem to get more views, but cool enough. There's a bald guy. Zero hair loss, man. No smoking. Yeah, no, it's not cool up there. Should have had a sign in here that said no shooting up. I'm just gonna peek and see. You'll see there's a little bit of asbestos wrapped on one of these pipes, I believe. It's just a little area. Some nice asbestos insulation. Like, subscribe, comment, and share. Thank you.